Hello, you beautiful people, and welcome back to Let's Play Ghost of Tsushima, where we actually have a long way in front of us. We need to travel to Fort Kamino Day, something like that. Didn't pronounce it correctly. Japanese ain't my um, primary language. So, once our horse is there, sadly enough, it's a longer way 890 meters it is but it should just be fine as soon as we are out of this small traveling route thing bamboo taking with and then we of course need to get down from the mountain and on it goes Okay, let's see if this is actually the right route. At least, what I can say, the direction is the correct one. I hope it just not does... It just doesn't lead us um, um, around this little mountain. Okay, here we can turn to the left and that route I should take. Okay, here we are. Okay, yes, I've ever seen the shrine. Maybe we... We, or I will take care of it on a, a later stage. Okay, I thought I was riding in the wrong direction. But obviously not, we can just follow this route neat and nice. For a change, I think it's very, very amazing to be into this binome. Nothing against the other two binomes we have been in. Um, well, to technically one, but um, with different stages. I want to do a standoff. Okay, it is not very good right now, since he heavily hit us, obviously. Oh god, this two-handed shield guy is pretty damn heart-hitting. I just need one more resource point. And then I am good to go on. I thought I dodged there. I really thought that. Okay, good. Then we are dead. It's a very, very good start to the mission. I think sometimes the, so to say, death animation, the death time is a little bit too high, I think, um, until they actually end our suffering like this one, it was really, really long, which feels then on the other hand a little weird to just wait to respawn. Maybe we can do a standoff right now. Come here and fight. As you can see, I'm I'm totally cold right now. I need to get used again. Okay, this is a brawler. I don't know which stance is the right. Okay, this is the correct stance then. Then that explains what I did wrong on the last battle here. Okay, good. I thought he has a shield, even though he's a bigger guy going up with him in the shield mode. But well, brawler mode it was. So only 250 meters remain. Um, obviously it is called a fort, so I expect um, some heavy fighting coming up. Good that we have had a little warm-up round against those 
Mongols, bandits, whatever they were. I think it was, were Mongols, right? And I see the fort already at the horizon to the right, top there. So let's quickly right there and free. To head for the woodcutter camp. Okay, this I thought is at least wood was cut it, obviously. Back away from the edge. I'll be right up. Sure you will. Yuna's got some interesting friends. Let's plan our attack. You can see inside from over here. We'll get on that roof. Control the high ground. <laughs> you sound like Yuna. She was a good teacher. <laughs> Archers on that ridge will have a good view of the courtyard. And plenty of targets. The bulk of our force should go there. You men with me. Everyone else, get to the ridge. If the enemy sees me, take them down. Understood. Good luck. Okay, they take care of the archers. Let them pass and then on it goes. I just follow those guys. Ah, okay, it's a... Oh my goodness. I was a little bit confused there. And attacking, of course, in the wrong stance. Well, not of course, but... Oh my god. Why did you do that, man? Okay, there's one more guy hiding like a coward. This was the guy I um, quite by accident did not completely kill and hit. And the good part is after that, um, to the next engagement I can have our ghost stance which will help out immensely. What sort of animals would do this? The Mongol kind. The woodcutters must have resisted them. Let's kill every bastard in this fort. Another patrol. We'll ambush them when they come through. Hide. You heard him. Move! Open fire on my signal. Let them get 
closer. Now, kill them all! Okay, that worked out perfectly. I heard Lord Shimura has an army with samurai from the Shogun. Why aren't you leading them? Lord Shimura has his plan to fight the Mongols. And I have mine. You're on your own. This fort isn't yours. That came from the southern gate. Had to see what's happening. Uh, she did that. We have to get over there. Let's get a look at the bridge. On the one hand, I heard Mongo. Okay, so wait. Leather taken the iron I should have taken with me as well, but well, fair enough. The Mongols sent most of their forces over there. This is our chance. If we charge across the bridge, we'll have to deal with that Huacha quickly. Could you sneak under the bridge with that hook of yours? Take the Huacha by surprise? Hmm. I can. I could grapple onto the tree and swing across. There's a way up the cliff on the other side. If they spot you, we can hit them with arrows. Charge across or sneak over. Either way, it'll be risky. We'll follow your lead, Lord Sakai. Get your people ready to move. <laughs> I thought I could go there. Okay. Um. Um. I don't want to charge across. I would like to take over the artillery. That is, believe it or not, that swinging around is so much fun in this game. So nicely done. Well, I, I mean, not nicely done how I'm swinging around, but the mechanic, I think, is very, very cool. One down. Another one down. And then I will mount and have a little tinsy bit of fun. Thank you for staying right in front of me. Okay, shooting at the wrong guys, they're very, very smart. Okay, let's dismount. And deal with them in close combat. Wrong sense is of course absolutely nice and ideal. Reinforcements on the way. Um, where are them reinforcements coming from? Is a big question. Can I? Yes, I can. Then let's dismount. We have to help my friends at the gate. And then reach our allies and bring the action to the enemy. Teveo, you brought some friends from Yarikawa. 
supposed to be ten feet tall. Keep fighting. Ten feet tall, yes. Like William Wallace. You finally got here. Don't get too close. They'll see me. Stay safe, Kenji. I'm trying. Get away. You should have waited for us to open the gate. <laughs> And the, this fast assassination thing is absolutely amazing. How many Mongols are left? Just the ones here. Then let's end it. And there should be one more. Okay. The fort is ours, my lord. Oh goodness. Okay, that was easier than I thought. Is everyone all right? Never better. All things considered. Good to see you, Lord Sakai. Uh, um, is it this cold everywhere up here? You'll get used to it. Take any supplies we need and prepare to ride for Jogaku. So. You and Takeshi. That was my old life. He and his people are more than hunters, aren't they? Depends on how you look at it. I told them they can stay and hold the pass for us. But I don't want bandits making trouble for innocent people fleeing the Mongols. He knows what I'd do to him if they tried. I think he's been looking forward to seeing you. He's seen me. We can go now. Let's get everyone to Jokaku. We'll plan our final attack from there. It's time for the Khan to die. <coughs> okay, wolves at the gates done for the last remaining minutes of this episode we can actually um, take a look on the map and decide what we wanna do there should be still a couple of quests um, on that island i have the strange feeling that we are nearing the end of this game very very quickly okay then let's talk to her um, there we are. Can I fast travel there? Okay, I don't see it. Okay. Then, let's just ride over there. The sister betrayed the tail is actually cold. Then at least, um, we have a little bit of a cl cliffhanger. Um, at least we will get to know what we have to do in the next episode. That is quite nice. If I'm even able to find her. Ah, okay, down there she is. I'm sorry to interrupt. You're not. You've been praying. To my ancestors, asking forgiveness for what I'm about to do. What do they say? I can't hear them. Perhaps your ancestors are silent because they can't do what you must. I know where my sister is. Clan Kikuchi's old fort. Then you're ready? I have no incense left to burn. No more prayers to make. The Kikuchi estate is this way. Okay, but that, guys, right now actually brings us to the end of this episode. 
and we will follow her in the next one for now you know it i as usual really really thank you for watching if you guys actually do have enjoyed this episode please give me a little thumbs up and subscribe and hopefully and hopefully i see you in the next episode until then have a nice day stay frosty bye